Loki, Hiddleston reveals how long he's known about the Disney Plus series. United Comics Universe. A universe for fans. From pages to pictures, we are comics. Please note, Hydra have been unsubscribing UCU family members. These are some of the reports that I have been receiving from the United Comic Universe family members. So please check to see if you are still subscribed to the channel. Also share our videos to others so they can see how awesome and different our channel is. Also like up. Each like up is a morale boost to all that is in the fight to take down Hydra. Hit the notification bell so you can be notified on the upcoming comic news. If this is your first time here, thank you so much for joining us. Please tap that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you can be a part of the fight to take down Hydra. Hello UCU family members, this is Jonin Show again, slicing and dicing it up as usual. Here we go with another rundown. This is an article from coming from CBR.com. Again, CBR.com is a great, great, great place to get news. It's all about comics, just like us. Really, really great place. I suggest you go check them out. If you want to see some of the art they have posted and read articles and enjoy yourself, good place to go. Until then, you can hear it from me. While news of a Loki series was only officially announced in April, it appears the series has been in the works for quite some time, or rather, quite a few years. Uh huh, you know how they do us, you know how they do us. Speaking to MTV News, Loki actor Tom Hiddleston revealed he was he has known about the Disney Plus series for a long time. In fact, he found out approximately six weeks before the release of Avengers Infinity War. Is that how you're going to do us, Tom? That's how you're going to do us? Do what you got to do, man. Do what you got to do. More power to you, bro. I like your performance. Keep it up. Hey, let, can we see Loki fully become a good guy? You know, I like heroes, not villains, but that's just me. Moving right along. I knew about six weeks before the worldwide release of Infinity War, he explained. I'm talking about Tom Hiddleston here. Related report. Loki Disney series sees God of Mischief altering historical events. Ah, that would be the Tesseract, a.k.a. the Space Stone. So, it looks like the Space Stone can not only travel through the space of its, uh, you know, constant universe, but it can actually travel through different space and time. So, I guess you don't need the Time Gem to go back in time when you have the space gem which can move anywhere and when it means says anywhere I guess it's meaning anywhere regardless of time so all you need to know I'm guessing is where you want to go and it will take you there I guess the space stone truly is amazing but in Loki's hand what is it I mean he's not a genius really he's not a genius I know y'all like Loki but he's very stupid he's very stupid of course, this meant the actor had to lie regarding his Marvel future while doing press for Infinity War. I had to go and do press, going up. Yep, that's it guys, he added. The actor also briefly touched on what it will be like to do the series, as the role will be the most time he's done as Loki since he joined the Marvel Cinematic Universe nine years ago. I know this character now, he said. I feel that the audience knows him, and playing him, and playing him truthfully, but presenting him with new challenges, which then I'd have to change him in different ways, is the most exciting aspect of it. Related, Loki Disney Plus series puts him in a context you've never seen him in before. I can't wait to see this. It's going to be so great to see what they do, how it's going to probably run into um, Thor Love and Thunder. That's my assumption. I would assume uh, this Loki TV series will some kind of way connect to Thor, Love, and Thunder. We shall see. How about that female Thor? I hear there's a lot of hype with that. I might cover that later. I don't know. If you want me to, just, you know, let me know down below. Maybe we'll do it. Maybe we won't. Depends on if you mean it or not. While little is known about the Loki series, it has been rumored that the show will see the God of Mischief altering historical events, according to Hiddleston himself. It will also see Loki go up against formidable opponents, although he couldn't go into specifics as to just which opponents he may be referring to. Oh, that sounds interesting. What if, 
we see the red man of death himself again since Loki can literally travel anywhere inside the MCU we may see the man himself the mad skeleton red skull we might see him again and what what will he do how will Loki deal with him can the military genius and malevolent tactics of the red skull go up against Loki the god of mischief I think not I mean he's got what maybe a thousand years on him we'll see what happens but do you think that Loki has taken the Tesseract aka the Space Stone only to end up having the Tesseract taken again from him by guess who an old friend of the Space Stone aka the Tesseract the Red Skull is this what's going to happen who knows but it sounds very interesting to me and I wouldn't mind seeing the Red Skull again but who's going to play the Red Skull is he going to reprise his role or they're going to go with the new guy Loki starring Tom Hiddleston is set to hit Disney Plus sometime in spring 2021 baby I, I'm telling you 2021 is going to be on absolute fire the things we're hearing about phase 4 is awesome phase 5 perhaps may even be more awesome cannot wait to see what they're going to do but it's looking very very amazing and now with Kevin Feige in charge of the television branch as well as the film branch uniting together he's going to weave the stories together in a magical tapestry that's just going to blow our mind and I can't wait to see it hear that Kevin Feige make sure you do it right the pressure is on you but we like what you do and keep it up Again, this is Jonin's show. You see you family. We love you out there. Thanks for taking the time to stop by and get your intel from us. And you and we are comics. United Comic Universe Store is now open where you can get awesome gear from leggings to hoodies. When you feel a little cold at night and the fireplace is just not working for you, Drink some of your delicious hot chocolate in your UCU mug. Drink it up. That's what I do. <laughs> oh, wait. When your feet is feeling a little cold at night, put on your United Common Universe socks to get the warmness only the United Common Universe socks can give you. Are you ready to gear up and take on Hydra? Well, the links is down below. Hit those links to gain access to all the awesome gear for you can join the fight to help take down Hydra. This has been United Comic Universe. Remember, we are comics. So, you like the video? Duh! That is why they're here, because they like the video. <laughs> awesome! So you subscribe, like, share, and don't forget to hit that notification bell, and also leave a comment down below. Also click one, or two, or three, or one of these playlists is going to be put somewhere around here so you'll see them to get more comic news. This has been another awesome video brought to you by United Comic Universe. Remember, we are comics.